to my videos. For anybody new here, my name is Joe. I inherited a farm from the old man after he passed away. These videos are kind of a record of my progress. So, um, I hope you liked the trucking video. It was about three days, well, kind of four days away. Um, got back on the last job and it was kind of a bit too late to travel back. So I travel back on the fourth day. So we are back. I've been back around a day, day and a half, something like that. Um, back to the everyday jobs. So I do have some things I need to do as a there is a big thing I need to sort out and also I have the excavator coming back to the farm today not by a, a friend it's kind of done by his friend so the friend that was helping me before is still over in Europe he was due to come back the day I came back from working sadly got held up and he's still over there right one thing I do want to do today as it's getting to that time again it is Halloween coming I believe so I want to go into town you can see here neighbor here has already got their stuff out so I want to go into town and pick some stuff up pumpkins or whatever kind of stick them outside the house not sure if I will do around the farm um, yeah definitely gonna have a couple of pumping pump kings if I can speak today outside the front of the house these are looking good got food Just gonna quickly check on the animals other than that, we are cleaning the spud still. Uh, a load of it went, a load of pallets went out just the day before I went trucking. So they have gone. We are supposed to be getting another load or another truck coming in about a week. I say a week's time. Um, I think it's about five, six days time. Need that to be loaded as well. Um, I think I'm going to put the excavator back here. I don't really have room in the shed for it. I would like to put it in the shed. I don't think it's going to go in there. Right, let's get back to what I had plans for. That reminds me, I need to get that auger put away. So we have some. Uh, uh, unexpected, unwanted visitors. If you're wondering what I'm on about, it is, if you remember, we cleared the site where the old house was, near the old yard. Um, I'm not sure when they moved in, but we do have some travellers that have moved over. Need some stuff around in here. So we go to go and see what's going on over there. And... Uh, see whether we can get rid of them. I don't have permission to be there. I'm not sure when they moved on site. I had planned to put a gate or a wall up. I didn't. I was going to do it when I come back. So that didn't happen. It's over here. Got to go and sort that out, see what's going on. First, I am going to take a trip downtown, down the village. Uh, I should be able to leave that running. See if I can pick up some pumpkins. That is my first job. Let's go and see what is available. If any. Yeah, 
It looks like the road closure is going to be on for a little bit longer. They've had to halt at work for whatever reason. So there's no work going on down there at the moment. Not sure what the problem is. Yeah, uh, had to stop. I'm guessing it's local authority that have stopped them. I have no idea. But that is going to be closed for a little bit longer than it probably should be. Other than that, it is coming into winter on the farm. So, drill work jobs are kind of done with now. I do need to spread uh, another layer of fertiliser in the next couple of days, maybe a week, for whether it turns really cold. Other than that, most of it is going to be around the farm jobs. Right, let me see if the garage has any pumpkins. Oh, I have a wander around a few shops we've got here. I don't need fuel. Right guys, shall we be back in a minute? Hopefully, with some pumpkins. Right, managed to get what I was after. That's good. Got a couple of pumpkins and uh, some bits for tonight's dinner. Oh, good. Right, I'm going to drop this lot at home. I'm going to head up and see what we've got in the way of travellers. I will say I don't know if they are travellers or just people that are looking for somewhere to stay. I do not know. Right, let's drop this at home. I need to drop in back at the farm. I believe the excavator has been delivered. There's a trailer there I want to get, which is going to be... I'm going to park it up at the other, in the shed at the other yard. Right, let me just drop this at home, uh, back indoors and I shall uh, head up to the traveller site. Okay, that's all been put away, except for the pumpkins that are on the side. What I remember, I can't remember which video it was, but I did mention about taking this out for a spin. Uh, there's a ruin somewhere over there, which I'll probably take you up there at some point to see what the track is like. That is still going to go ahead. This is running. Um, I believe I'm just waiting on uh, what they call an MOT, make sure it's roadworthy. Hopefully, take it out up there and check out the ruin. Let's quickly uh, jump in and need to get that trailer while I remember. Let's see where he's... I think I know where he's put the excavator. So we'll have to move that, but I will do that when I come back. I'm going to have to have a look and see what is the process for removing these people. Hoping it's not a long process, but for some reason, I have a feeling it's going to be a long process. Right, I believe the, uh, the grab that I took the building down with is gone. It's just the bucket next to it. There it is. So that's back. It used to be. Try and hook this trailer up if I can. Okay. Make sure the spud washer is okay. Those going. It's all got a box ready. Let's see if I can get a, a lock for the trailer so nobody can tow it away. Let's go and see where or what travellers are doing. What, what 
mess they've made. Okay, just heading up to where they are. This field over here is looking really good. See what we got. I've been told there's caravans and tents, so I don't know. Looks like the police are here as well. We got two caravans, two tents, two vehicles. Okay. Not sure what I was going to expect, but yeah. Don't know how long they've been here. Oh, what they're doing here for that matter. Make sure everything in here is okay. There's uh boys JCB. Could be in the way for where I want to get to. If I can. That's not gonna work. Let's do this properly, shall we? getting stuck here. Let me sort this out. I'll be back in a minute. There we go. We're in. That's where it's going to sit. So I'll get it a lock or something so they can't tow it, take it. I think I've got one indoor somewhere or in the box. So everything seems good here. Everything seems to have gone, which is good. Barricaded the gateway as well. Which is not good. Okay. Is there anybody here? made a mess so I don't know how long they've been here. I don't know where they are. I mean the caravans are wide open. They are well they haven't spoke to me about parking up here. So I think I'm gonna have a word with the officer over there, see what he knows, if anything. So see if I can find somebody, somebody out of here, preferably, that owns them, and find out what they're doing. Back in a minute. Right, somebody's story is not adding up. So what I know so far, according to the officer, um, they got notified of them, I think it was the day after, I left to do the tr uh, truck in. The uh, landscaper has just come back. Apparently, they moved on the night, the day I left to do the trucking job, they had moved on that night and he noticed them the following morning. He did send me a message which I did receive. That's how I knew they were up here. Uh, these are claiming that it's theirs, their land. They own it, although can't. They've not really shown any proof. Um, I mean, 
technically, I know they don't have to. Um, I've been asked by the officer to grab the information I've got on the land, so I will go back and do that. They are basically refusing to move and claiming they own the land. So that's where we are at the moment. So I've now got to go back, get the paperwork I've got, so the officer can see it. But, uh, I think it's going to be a process, a long process, to get these moved. I'm going to have to have a look into it. Right, landscape has come back, so should be good. Chop the wheels on that uh, trailer. I did. So that's what I know so far. Right, head back to the farm. Come back. He's going to drop in later on to have a look at the paperwork I've got. He did say, don't think there's nothing he can do. But I don't know on that one. It's just something I'm going to have to look into by the look of it. Bit of a pain. I should have really put that gate up before I left. That would have stopped him. Although... If they determined to get on there, they would have got on there either way. Even if I left the safety fence up, which is now gone. So, another problem I've got to solve. Right, these fields are looking really good. We'll see you back at the farm. Right, just arrived back at the farm. I'm going to quickly load the spot washer up because it looks like it's going to be empty by the time we two boxes, shall I say, the amount of time we've been away. Just hoping not to be away that long. empty but not far off it. Like here because I need to get those two boxes. Right, I think I'm going to end the video here for now. Um, you've seen me a couple of times do the spuds so I'm not going to recall all that again. Let's get as well. Anyway, I'm going to end the video here. Thank you ever so much for watching. I seriously hope you enjoyed. I know it's been a lot of me driving around today. A lot of videos from now on are probably going to be me driving around and doing stuff around this place. Animals and everything else. I may even, if depending on what the weather's like later on this year, end up getting some snow. So that's another job we'll have to do. Uh, we'll get the pumpkins that I bought today all carved out out the front and uh, show you the end result on the next video so thank you for watching bye bye for now mm -hmm.